Hey guys, we're going to review the three types of angles. We're going to label each one as acute or smaller than right, obtuse, bigger than right, or the right angle itself. So this one is the right angle. Notice how it has the sharp corner and the little square. That's how we know this one is a right angle. And now let's look at this one. This one is much smaller. You see how it could even fit inside the right angle? This one is much smaller, so it is acute. Do you remember in class? We remembered that by saying it was a cute little angle. Okay, and then we have this one, number three. Well, this one is much bigger than the right angle. In this case, the right angle could fit inside. When it's much bigger than the right angle, we call that one obtuse. Okay, so let's review them real quick. We have acute, a small one that would fit inside the right, obtuse, the bigger one where the right angle could fit inside it. Okay, so let's review the other ones. And let's see if we can figure out what they are. Okay, so let's look at number four. Number four looks pretty small to me. I think it would probably fit inside our right angle. So what do you think, guys? Is it acute, like number one? Or is it obtuse, like number three? Okay, look at number four. I'll pull back a little bit so you can see them all together. Okay, and I'll give you a couple seconds to think about it. What kind of angle is number four? You guessed acute. Good job. Number four is also a cute little angle. Okay, let's look at number five. Okay, this one's called MMO. That's the name of it. Well, does this one look like it could fit inside? Or like this one could fit inside this one. What do you think, guys? Is this one acute, right, or obtuse? Okay, you guys are right. That one is also acute. Okay. Now, let's look at this one. This is number six. PQR is its name. So there's something special about number six. Let's compare it up here. Is it acute, right, or obtuse? If you guys picked right angle, good job. You can tell because it's got that sharp corner with a little square in it. Okay, let's look at number seven. STU is its name. Does this one look more like acute, right, or obtuse? That's right, guys. It's obtuse because it is much bigger than the right angle. Okay, let's look at number eight. BWX. Okay, what does this one look like? Acute, right, or obtuse? That's right, guys. It is a cute little angle. All right, let's look. Number nine. 
Y, Z, A. Okay, this one looks like it's pretty big to me. So what do you think, guys? Is it acute, right, or obtuse? That's right, guys. That is much bigger than a right angle, so it is obtuse. Okay, let's look at number 10. What does this one look like, guys? Acute, right, or obtuse? You're right, guys. Obtuse. It's much bigger than the right. Okay, look at number 11. Okay, is that one acute, right, or obtuse. What do you think, guys? That's right. It is another example of a right angle. See the little sharp corner and the little square. Okay, guys, you have one left. Look at number 12. Is it acute, right, or obtuse? That's right, guys. It is acute because it is smaller than the right triangle, than the right angle. Good job, guys. You're doing great. Acute little angle, right angle, and obtuse. Good job, guys.